Here's a review that um, is uh, one of those sort of ivory tower reviews by someone who uh, looks at the research on natural products and tosses out most of it because it's not big enough studies because they're used to seeing these giant $100 million drug company clinical trials. Um, but even with that type of uh, scrutiny, um, in this review, he, um, was, he was willing to uh, agree that phosphatidylserine was an evidence-based intervention. He concluded that among older adults with cognitive, cognitive impairment that can be considered moderate, phosphatidylserine has produced consistently moderate, moderate increases in memory performance, and that for the cued semantic memory verbal uh, test, the PS group recalled about 50% more items than the placebo group after three months of treatment. So very significant effects on memory. Um, he's, he's basically one of these tongue-in-cheek kind of writers. He quotes the title of the uh, best-selling book, A Memory Cure, that was written by uh, Dr. Thomas Crook, who's um, a psychologist that worked at the NIH and conducted the initial studies on phosphatidylserine, showing that it had very substantial benefits in memory, and he wrote a book called The Memory Cure. So he's uh, putting that in there just in sort of a sarcastic way, but he's still saying it works. So it's, uh, it's quite interesting that even the ivory tower says that uh, phosphatidylserine works.